Hello there, this is a How It's Going with Pastor Owen video on July 24th, 2023. Hope you're having a good day. Yesterday was the eighth Sunday after Pentecost and uh, Jesus had a parable of the wheat and weeds um, in which we're actually both. Yeah. Saint and sinner grow together, roots intertwined for a time. Uh, he's got a good word that frees the new you to be harvested into the good barn while, well, the old you doesn't like this, uh, has an end date. We'll come to an end uh, and not make it to that barn. Uh, Pentecost 9, so the ninth Sunday after Pentecost is... Uh, looking at a few more parables, uh, the first of which is uh, the kingdom of heaven being like a treasure hidden in the field. So it should be an interesting sermon that comes out of this. Uh, Dave Cruz will be speaking that to your ears on Sunday as we uh, go on a vacation. We've got a family vacation, us hoigs. Uh, that begins tomorrow, Tuesday, and we'll get back next Thursday. So we've got some miles to travel, um, national parks to see, and um, we're really looking forward to spending some time together as a family and and uh, seeing God's good creation out there too. So uh, we will miss some things about summer in Iowa. But it's God's good creation other places too. It's hard to believe, but we're going to see it. Uh, there is still uh, some sand volleyball to watch if you want to go there. If you want to play, uh, we kind of took four players, so four of our typical players out when we went on a family vacation here. So uh, a lots of fun that league has been and, and will be on Wednesday night too. Uh, on Sunday, we'll have worship at 9.30. Junior Lutherans, if you're available, if you'd like to pick corn uh, across the street at Brent and Starless Place, uh, it will be ready to pick and then sell to those of you who are hungry for that sweet corn. So that's next Sunday, July 30th, um, for that one. So hopefully you can make it to that and share in worship together and also some fellowship and uh, maybe even get some sweet corn too. We've got quite a few birthdays today, so happy birthday to the following members of our congregation, Marjorie Tiedemann, that's today, happy birthday. Carol, that's coming up on Thursday, happy birthday to you, Carol. Uh, Wayne has a birthday on Friday. Happy birthday, Wayne. Derek Wellendorf also has a birthday on Friday. And then on Sunday, Warren Tiedemann celebrates a birthday. So happy birthday to you. Uh, we've also got an anniversary to celebrate. That's today. A uh, special day for Jeff and Luella Tekken. All right. Uh, Romans 8, again, is on our... Uh, in our lectionary readings for this upcoming Sunday, and it really gets to, man, perhaps the most wonderful promise of, in all of Scripture. Apostle Paul is setting something up here. Who will bring any charge against those whom God has chosen? It is God who justifies. Who then is the one who condemns? No one. Christ Jesus, who died, more than that, who was raised to life, is at the right hand of God, and is also interceding for us. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? There's almost a taunt that comes from the pen of the Apostle Paul here. And he does answer that question. And it's beautiful. So read on. Um, nothing in all of creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. It's pretty good news right there. May that news be with you today and always. All right. Talk to you later.